Alright, so in this one, we are going to be using LF Blue Beast Gohan since we do have another Beast Gohan. Very surprising from Legends Fest to release another Beast Gohan, quite literally a year after the, uh, well, the first one, okay, 13 months, sorry, 13 months after the first one, because, uh, Blue Beast came right before Legends Fest last year, this guy came right at Legends Fest, the beginning of it, uh, again, very shocking that we got, basically, two Beast Gohan within a 13-month span, most characters do not get a new iteration of themselves until, like, years, I mean, LSL, we just got a new LSL, right, name it Goku, that was five years differential, and Beast said, no, I am new content for Dragon Ball, so I am here. And here he is. I mean, does that really make much sense? I mean, money-wise it does, but overall it's like, oh, can we do these other moments a lot more? FSK! Thank you very much, I appreciate that. But, this character, not much has uh, really aged them. I mean, this character kind of defined the power creep that we have uh, currently been withholding and, uh, you know, going through within the last, uh, I would say, since his release of a uh, year ago and some change here so yeah not much is gonna change if there's anything that's gonna be a little bit different about him it's that he's gonna be a little bit less bulky um clearly you know on feature boost all these other things that he had prior when he was in his heyday are not there anymore and then the utility of overall units is just higher like you look at the red beast so the blue beast obviously utility is much higher but their damage caps are not very you know differential um they still hit uh, similar ceilings if not basically I do think Blue Beast hits a little bit harder uh, earlier on because he's already in Beast. You have to transform do all that, uh, you know, extra shit there. But team-wise, is going to be hybrids of being Gotenks, giving some HP, Pan giving some uh, Strike Tech there, then Zenko buffing Blue Beast, and then one too is Zenko buffing both Pan and the Ultimate into Beast Gohan there. Equip-wise for Blue Beast will be as follows, with it being, by the way, the uh, Ultra, I believe it is. Upgrade Bonanza is here. Uh, I, I don't really notice too much of a difference, but I do notice I am getting... If there is anything to notice i'm getting much more close to perfect rolls just by randomly re-rolling equipment so if you want to get some equipment to godly z plus i would say z plus is enough even z is enough but if you want to get these you know cool little symbols uh do it now it lasts until the 10th so you got quite a ways to go but i do recommend people do it they literally are giving out like do the raid you get gold bars gold bars for zenny zenny for rerolling equipments you get erasers there's five different raids to get erasers from like you got the resources to do it. You just got to put that time in. And honestly, uh, well, if you care about this game, you know, it is definitely worth it for you to do. But uh, speaking of that, I need to get to two more beasts to Godly because this is the only one I have at Godly. This clip here, being Strike Defense, Pure Strike, Pure Blast there. Obviously, hybrids, best peers. So let's run hybrids here. This here, being Blast Defense, Strike Tech, Special Damage, then Strike Tech there. Then this clip here being a uh, very good peer overall, just for every Sun Family character, right? Being Strike Defense, Strike Defense, pure Strike Tech, because full Sun Family, and then Blast Defense, and then a pure Blast there. I was originally going to run Go Tanks, but then I wanted to run this peer, so I swapped it out for Pan, and then Pan works anyways, because you're seeing a lot of double reds regardless. And, uh, well, hey, help against Omen, and Omen is a bit of a dilemma right now. With that being said, let us see what the original Beast Gohan Blue Beast can do in PvP in 2024 at 14 stars. Beast first match that is something some interesting if you don't know about blue beast well let me give you some rundown on him he has covered all for 15 time accounts on his entry because he has his full gauge that lasts obviously again 15 time accounts there so at 165 we lose our cover and all but we could beat the shit out of him here green card with the gauge filled it does give you type neutral as well as you can see here we are hitting piccolo much harder in this setting and uh well he's just overall gonna be a very good character as you could uh Remember and imagine. As you can see, this combo is still going. He's going to swap here. Yep, that was type neutral. And, I mean, that's a lot of damage for a character that's over a year old, right? Yeah, and this guy introduced power creep. So him doing, like, what he's going to be doing isn't even out of the ways of, like, whoa, that's crazy. Like, yes, 13 months old. I understand it could look a bit crazy for 13 months old to do that. But, to be fair, he did introduce where we are. So it's, like, it's not that outlandish, but is a bit interesting play um i mean we'll just stay my red beast here there's no real need to swap yeah this is fine because i go to blue beast i you know do my uh blue card there's type neutral 
is fine. Okay. This green card, by the way, does remove enemies, uh, entire hand when it is filled. So right here, I didn't remove it, but if it's filled, it removes entire hand. I believe twice it does that. It's pretty, uh, nifty, if I say so myself. Do have a situation to rush here. A bit tough, because I go Frieza, but, you know, probably can make it work. Oh. Please don't have a rush. I mean, you can't do it anyways. Blue Beast does gain endurance on a rush, so he wouldn't die here if he were to rush me. I mean, that's whatever. I don't think that's too bad. It's gonna be a free hit, right? But it's gonna happen regardless. Green card. Very lucky to get a green card right there, huh? Okay. Well, that's tough. I expected a drop. It's not. Well, <laughs> I would rush if I could, but he's going to be mid-action, or rather not mid-action, so this actually counts to uh, an against-me setting. I can't rush there. It's not going to let me. Like, I can, but he's going to, you know, do his Goku Frieza thing where they can't get hit by it. Unfortunately. I mean, we'll just throw this out, get some damage done, and swap pool. I'd like to get my rush back. Interesting. Cool. You don't have any blast cover change here. I can probably extend this at least a little bit. Not as long as I'd like to, though. So I want to get it to where I can rush. Right now, that is not looking likely. Nah, it's still going to be up. Nah, it's a pain. The gauge is basically gone now, but... Now it's gone, exactly. Yes, him. Green card early. <laughs> full. He had a full hand. Good for you. Well, Blue Beast got endurance here, so I guess that's something. But yeah, I got to rush off. That's all that matters. Dead. Type neutral. There you go, Blue Beast. Yes, sir. My attack on this setting here. No, he just run away. Okay, cool. I know you're scared of a rush. Right. Just run away to tap bait, really. Okay. Ah, great. <laughs> kind of funny. Just a little bit. A little bit. Man, you're just gonna tap it the entire time now, huh? That's good. That's good. <laughs> Man, you're just gonna keep doing nothing back there, huh? <laughs> Alright, uh, we're getting to that point of the match. I understand. Literally, I understand. It's gonna be the runaway setting. I gotcha. Guess me as well? Great. <laughs> it really was getting to there. He was just gonna run back, tap bait, blast over, run back, tap bait. I got it, bro. I got it. Don't worry. Come on, let's do the tap baits. Come on. Great. You snooze, you lose. He actually aggressed there, which I'm very surprised by. Don't expect any aggression to happen in this match uh, after that, you know, initial setting of the runaways here the beginning. As you can see here, you know, being a shit out of red unit is very nice. <laughs> but he's doing it well. Um, interesting match. I don't know about that team, because it's not even that safe. Like, against my team, it's very good, but my team is pretty inferior to the uh, others. Because hybrids... I always have, like, this weird setting, like, yeah, Pan's pretty good on it, you know, Gotenks pretty good, I guess Gotenks is kind of worse value, because what do you need Gotenks for? There's no purples. Uh, Cape, Gohan, any of those three, they kind of just, like, a slap a damage dealer, damage dealer, it's like, okay, now go, go do something. I don't think running, like, Cape, 
and pan or go tanks and pan or you know whatever uh duo support and then if red beast works out i think you need a support damage damage so it's like blue beast or or like there's no other or right like we need a new hybrid uh third here like i think you can run a support and get away with it on hybrids just because they amplify themselves so much in like their uh their settings right i don't think other teams need that but hybrids can kind of get away with it but you replace this guy because really he is kind of like that third like what do you really run yeah double support just doesn't feel correct it's so inconsistent because you just die out very easily on some bullshit um so double damage this feels better off this guy can still argue that as core on hybrids now hybrids isn't fantastic but it's solid and uh again 13 months old so you kind of want to replace at this point High star reps here. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, uh, why not go blue beast? Right, what do I lose? Nothing, really. Uh, once you swap, I will do that blue card, which I feel like you will swap because Omen is a, uh, Omen's just a smarter setting to be in with. Oh, there you go, because you can stop my other cards, right? Solid damage. L17 took quite an ass beating there. Not really the ideal for a character. Got a lot of blue cards here. Oh, that was a little bit delayed. I thought I was gonna miss because that delay. Okay. Yeah, raw blue cards. I know you're uh, especially spooked by Mister Mister Omen over there. I know you don't like that shit. Get your ass beat by that. I know. I'm gonna swap, but hey, type neutral should do at least. <laughs> Maybe something. Oh boy. This could be trouble. Oh, blue cards I'm getting. That was interesting. That was interesting. We'll just do this. I know, I know. You can, yeah, I know. I feel like you're not expecting another blue. I wouldn't expect four blues either. That's some bullshit that I got that many blues, but you know, Legends things. I should have done that. That was just unnecessary, and I fucked myself because we're great. I didn't have to do that. I didn't think he'd go for a strike, to be fair. I was kind of predicting a blast there, but... He went over my expectation on that. Pop off, pop off. I can't do anything about this. Tag out. Okay. I guess he wasted the first one. Or used it, rather. Ah. The L17's a nothing, right? He doesn't really mean shit to me, but me having four blasts here... Uh, yeah, that means something. Come on, Legends. Four Blast. What are we doing? He goes type neutral defensively on his entries. That's why Blue Beast isn't getting murdered. Holy shit, green cards. Kind of like my blue cards that were happening. Just out the ass here. That's whatever. I think I'm just going to transform just to kind of get this guy out of my fucking face. I'm kind of fucking tired of Evo. I don't know if he's quick dashing or something. It looks like he was about to quick dash there. Hopefully I'm... Not incorrect. Okay, I was incorrect. Got it. Hello? Hello? Whoa, the lag! What the fuck was that shit? That was fucking awkward. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, you're gonna get your ass beat here. Again, you're just not a tank. I mean, I've said this six trillion times by now. LS17 can't take hits. And lo and behold, he's not taking hits. He's dying. Goodbye. I thought he was going to swap by accident. You know when you misclick swap it, it's like, oh, shit. I was hoping that would happen there, just for my sake. Great. I noticed a lot of times people do not want to swap out of their Vegeta, of their uh, Evo Kaioken. They're like, bro, let me stay. I couldn't even tell who did a blue card away. Sidestep? No? Wow. Bro just goes mid-range strike. He saw he has stars, and he's like, Gator Range Strike is the play. Don't question me. I got it. Well, now you don't, but, you know, this is feasible. Goodbye, see you later. Also, Red Beast, obviously, as it should be. This should not be the thing that's like, yeah, the other one does it better. Red Beast, obviously, has the better LF between the two. Uh, for one, the ending. For two, there's actually, like, some startup to it here. It feels like a... Uh, a more earned LF, and on top of 
I don't even think you're gonna see Blue Beast LF often. Like, a blue card to an ultimate, you're gonna see the blue card one. Which makes me think, how many blue card LFs do we have? I feel like we have quite a bit, like, within the last two years of, uh, you know, the previous, and then this one just ended in 2023. I actually want to look, because, you know, Beast Gohan is one of the characters, right? And I used the fours as well last video. How many do we have from this last little setting we've had here? We got one, two, Goku, Bardock, Evo, uh, Kaioken, Vegeta, three in Pycon, Gogeta, four in the last four characters. Four of the last four are blue card LFs. It's kind of fucking crazy. Uh, Cell is five. Piccolo is six. Gamma, I guess Gammas aren't a card, so I can't count that. Damn. We have UI, seven. Have we gotten seven blue card LFs recently? It's funny because we have like Janemba. Okay, he debuffs. Ultimates or Omen debuffs ultimates. Like, Ultras are like hurting other Ultras and they're not hurting the LS. While well, LS are kind of just like doing their own thing. Because, <laughs> yeah, Ultras are debuffing these big ultimates. LS 17 debuffing this big ultimate. Like, these things here. And then prior to that year, we had the Fours VT and then not much. I mean, literally, the Fours VT droids. And that's, that's it, right? Because then Bardock was the start of a new year. Damn. Oh, damn, they really doubled down that blue card LF shit, huh? Jesus, I mean, look at <laughs> Green Revival Musketeers right here. <laughs> fucking stupid. That's not even on purpose. That's just when you pulled them because they all came out, I guess, four months to one another over there. Um, That's <laughs> hilarious, actually. Damn, got a lot of those blue card LFs, which is good for, like, seeing it. I guess they want you to see LFs more, which, you know, they put their time into it. That makes sense. But compared to last year, it's quite literally triple. I mean... Two to seven, it's triple, right? God damn. Androids? What is what is the, the purpose of this situation here? I am confused. <laughs> I guess I have said before, you know, androids do want a red unit, and that is an argument that is, well, not even an argument, that is true. They do want a red unit, but beast? I don't know. I don't know about beasts on androids, but hey. Why not try it out, right? What do you lose? Could be a match, but you know, who cares? It's not that deep. Oh, that subtown manipulation. That blue beast is somehow already back. That is so moronic. Okay. No problem. I mean, once you red, you don't want blue. I don't know if that's ideal. That's good, 50 50. Good for you. I'm going for blast. Still gonna go. Let's get out, I guess. Interesting play. I still don't understand what this team is meant to be doing in any capacity. Oh, sure, I'll take that, I guess. So it's not like LO17 can, you know, once again, be tanky, but. Blue Beast, or Red Beast, rather. Is he built for Blast? I'd assume so, right? I feel like that's a pretty easy assumption to make. I thought he was going to do the main ability and catch me. Good thing he didn't! Why are you trying to kill the bug man? Do you want him dead? I mean, I could help you out with that. Maybe not fully. Okay. <laughs> but I could try. <laughs> it's fine. Do this. Um, You want to swap, feel free. But, like, I'm going to click my button here. Okay. <laughs> Once again, I've said six trillion times, he cannot tank. He's going to take a lot. He's almost dead. That almost one-shot him. Blue Beast. And you love just going, huh? You are not even thinking about it anymore. I mean, you'll swap here, right? I, I would assume. Okay. I feel like you want to transform. I'm trying to delay it as much as possible. Or not. Bro did not care. All right. Um, I mean, he could rush me here, right? That's kind of the thing he probably wants to do. Do you have a rush? Are you lucky enough to have a rush already? You haven't really landed much. I mean, one combo, right? Landed one combo, I don't have a rush. I've landed like four. So I'm just saying. Why would you not? I was going to say, like, just insta-transform there, right? Let's find out. I mean, who knows? I can't dodge this. I'm just fucked, so... 
Oh, or you fumbled the bag six times over. How? What? Why did you? All right. Oh, I can sidestep. Sure. Oh, I could. You're not gonna kill anybody here. You ain't got that dog in you, buddy. You can't do it, LF17. You are shit at damage. You are not that guy. Sucks. Tragic. Hey, you're your old. About to be. You're, you're the the come up, LF. Uh, about to be a year old. You're literally on the cusp. I mean, I'd like to save this if possible, so let's uh, let's save my transformation. Why not? Did I lose anything by doing that? Will you swap? It'd be a little bit silly to, you know, risk it, but... Do you, I guess. Well, the smart play is this. Then the other smart play is this. And then the match is over. Well, unless RNG wants to prevail, but who knows. No. No RNG allowed. Thank you. That was a... Interesting. I want to see the stars on that team. Because LS17, while I say he can't tank, he took, I mean, like 95% from one ultimate, right? Obviously, he wasn't in prior, so he wasn't debuffing the ult. LS17 really wants to be in prior. Uh, that ultimate does, like, I want to say, you know, 40%. Like, 60% if he's in prior in that setting, right? I want to see. That was a 10 star. Again, I understand Blue Beast is not power crept by any means in his output, but, like, the 10 star LS17 took that much. 95% basically. He, he was dead. He was on Dev's door, right? 95, 90%. Jesus. <sighs> like, Cell looked pretty bulky. I guess Cell probably doubles in kind of buffs as he would be. Beast on leader. Yeah, LS17. It's not even not his own fault because, like, it just happens. People get higher damage. Though it's Blue Beast, he doesn't really have that high damage compared to other characters that could have higher. Um, still gets a pretty decent peak, but, like, nothing compared to, like, Jinemba or Omen or some shit like that. Um, give this man a Zen cut buff, bro, because without it, I mean, you're seeing shit like that from a character that's over a year old. It's like, you don't want to see that. You don't want to, and I guess it, like, you know, fine, fair. They are, um, a couple months apart, right? This guy about to be a year old. This guy a little bit over a year old, but again, this guy is the older one. So it's, <laughs> oh, he needs a Zen cut buff so bad. Like blue 13, you know, turn power 18, I don't know who else. Those are just some options. I guess Topo gives double defense ability, right? Um, Basil. I think he has strike tech, I think. Yeah, but probably not him. But, like, Topo or Blue 18. Like, those are the two main ones. 18, obviously, being better because Androids. And then Uni Reps. Topo would just be Uni Reps that he runs on the uh, Z ability. But uh, you got to give this guy a Zenkai buffer, bro. Because they're going to kill LS17. Not because he's bad. It's just because units hit so hard like that just inevitably happens and it's happening to him here you can watch it in front of you he is just falling and falling and falling because he has no zen cut off to really give him real you know awful um not awful awfully amazing defenses um right now his defenses are pretty piss poor sun family let's get it why does that always work no if you're curious why people do that play, I could explain it to you here, which I will. Um, so, some people get frazzled at that point, right? They see them blast through. They're like, I hit them, but like they blasted through. So a lot of players will actually just kind of stand still and wait for a sidestep. Though, as you saw right there, you can just simply attack and then you're kind of over that hurdle. And uh, again, it's meant for players to get frazzled, right? I did this assuming swap into Gohan. But uh, if you see someone do that against you, probably means like, decent they know what they're doing they know that that is a thing that can frazzle players and if you do that it could be smart people would uh get caught out because of it i mean you don't have too much key here you can't literally you can't a few green cards though cool I have a russian hand that's pretty neat sure Please don't PP this, that'd be awesome. Great. Cool. Didn't swap. He didn't swap! <laughs> that was just 50 50s. Either he swaps to go on there, he kind of just like assumes I'm gonna go for some crazy shit, or he auto dodges and attempts. Well, fuck! I make the right play, I did everything perfect. 
and then I get fucking punished for it. Thank you, Legends. I appreciate you. Here's the cards in hand. I just destroyed his entire hand there. Okay, I'm gonna tackle again. Why did Legends fuck me over? Why? Enjoy. Pan! Probably gonna come in. Oh, it's so annoying, bro. Because I make the right play, it's like, yep, yeah, punish. It's like, bro. So why even give me the opportunity to make the right play? Just don't even give me the chance, bro. Can you stop with these dumbass rocks? Get the hell out of here. I mean, you're not the one I want dead, but like, sure, I, I guess. I'll take it. And there's a PB. Can't fucking Oh, uh, no. That was a bit silly of you. I appreciate it. You know, obviously, again, yeah, gains endurance on Rising Rush there. Who else does that? Someone else does that. Someone not... Someone does that. Who the fuck gains endurance on Rush? Someone else that came out, like, near Blue Beast does that. I remember. I just don't know who. I guess that means I don't remember. We're gonna do this with the Omen shit. Okay. I didn't pop any yet. Ooh, good for me. I get to have that. Oh, uh, Eric's gonna PV fish with this, because you're down a character. Sure, let's fish together. Very patient, but not enough. Goodbye. Transform! Go! I'm not gonna waste time here, so we're just gonna pop this here. You backdash. <laughs> Were you scared? <laughs> that was kind of adorable. Bro was like, oh shit! You guys got a card, huh? Oh shit! Fucking spooked out. That's twice. Unlucky. Whatever. Um, do your thing. Sucks I can't get my ult, but you know. Have fun. Cool, cool, cool. I mean, you got nothing, bro. You got 100 counts. You gotta live through all this bullshit I got. You know, good luck, have fun with that, really. I mean, you can't even kill Pan here out of everybody, so it's like... Yeah. How safe are you to win this? Cool, I do not care. Damn, who's the character I'm thinking of? I don't know. Cool. And Blue Beast will take care of you, and, uh, well, murder your soul! Goodbye! Who am I thinking of? Also, with Blue Beast, you can notice that, like, it's more equivalent damage. You know, with, like, Red Beast, you're seeing, like, the first attack of his blue card. You do kind of meek, and it's like, oh, what's going on? Then you see, like, the end of it, it's like, oh, shit! Like, it fucking murders you. Blue Beast, it's more 50% first hit, 50% second hit. And it's like, oh, okay, you can kind of, like, gauge more. Which actually threw me off when I was doing test matches. So, like, I thought this would kill because I expected the Red Beast, like, big output at the end. But, no. Who am I thinking of here? That gains endurance on Rush that's not Blue Beast. There, there was somebody. Hold on. I, I'm sorry. I'm curious. Who the fuck is it? What do you think of... Let's see, I guess. Blue Beast era. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Blue, 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 You are over here. Who gained endurance on Rush? Somebody. No? Somebody gained something. I don't know. If you know who I'm referring to. Um, this kid boot cancels buffs? That's not what I'm thinking about, though. What the fuck am I thinking about? Someone. Hello? Am I just stupid? I'm just stupid. I don't know who I'm thinking about. We move on. Young family again. Sure. I don't know why I'm getting kind of just fed TVs. I mean, I'll take it. I'm still confused by it. Go for the strike, just because. Kinda... Actually, I don't that. I was like, kinda hoping for a blast there, but... I wasn't expecting it. So we're swapping out just smarter, overall. Could catch him and just kinda murder him, if I get lucky. Hopefully. I mean, he's not dead here, but like, you know, he's gonna be close. Oh, is he? See that extra though? That beginning to that ending, it's like, holy shit. Like, you can't anticipate what's gonna be the actual output. That's obvious. Appreciate that. We'll do this. I would have loved to strike there personally, but you know, who am I to choose? I did that thinking he would swap, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know why I thought he'd swap, but I did think he'd swap. Oh, why, why'd you swap there? You're literally typing in, shalom. 
always in that setting. It's just sidestep. You really usually won't get caught. But uh, oh that that was some bullshit. I did not deserve that. There's a drop. I'm just transforming because why would I save it? What the hell am I gonna save this for? You know, he's not gonna beat the shit out of me to like get my gauge here. It's not likely, at least. Uh, whatever. I don't care about that. He can transform right here. I'm literally fucked. I mean, well now I'm not, but I was. Uh, nothing really can go wrong, I would say, fully. Even before something goes wrong. Oh, full screen striking with this point. We've given up all hope, I see. That's tough. Can I get my LF? I should go hard here. There you go. I cannot kill you. I don't think that can kill. I mean, I don't think so. Nope. Blue Beast! Your blue card definitely does feel a little bit, uh, well, worse off. It's lack like a better term. That worked. The strikes feel very good, but like that blue card does not feel like a blue beast blue card. I mean, can I get the LF? I'd like to see it. It's been a good minute, really. And it will still be a good minute. Fantastic. We move on. Hopefully things go well. Woman on the movies. Indubitably. It's tough. Tough. Let's get this shit out of the way. Two reds. Tough shit for you. You gotta waste some moves here that you don't want to use. And well, there's one of them. The beauty of two reds. I don't think it's needed, but like, for here, it was just so easy to run. Why not do it? Do we have vanish back? What? I mean, you can't click a card here. He has no cards, so hopefully I can catch him. <sighs> Society. Aren't I still type neutral? Isn't it three counts? I did not think he'd waste main ability there. That was a genuine waste. That's a team heal. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> sure. What the fuck? <laughs> the hell, dude? Why would you waste your main? <laughs> I mean, it worked. But, like, it's a waste. And that, there's four or three green cards already. Jesus Christ. What the hell's going on here? All right, let's... We got lost points, so... Oh, you're gonna let him revive. I don't know about all that, but, you know, you do you. Um... Dude, that was... Oh, went to the green card, right? That was four greens already? Hello? Like, hello? What's going on here? I have four blasts. This is complete dog shit. Well, maybe we can make it work. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, good luck for you. God damn, bro. Another green. Okay. You're just popping every main so fast, and it's kind of just like overly doing it. But hey, it's gonna work, so congrats. I don't know about that play, but uh, interesting enough. What? Okay. Swap! I assume the pre-swap there, and I think that was a pre-swap that wasn't, you know, uh, on purpose. I would assume you'd keep Omen alive over Piccolo, even with the color situation going on here. Because Piccolo dies, your ultimate neutral. So it's a, keep him alive. Interesting. Yeah, this guy's just, like, clicking without, um, much processing. Like, that's not even, like, a bad thing to say. It's just accurate. Like, look, he's just clicking. Like, he's just clicking. See what I mean? Rush? Well, I rush pan, I don't, you know, I don't lose anything. I lose support that I don't really need. And you actually are gonna waste it. I don't know about that one, but you do. You got no main here at Piccolo. Tough. I mean, I could just tackle, right? Am I not just free to tackle? I could also go into Beast. The Red Beast. That's tough. I mean, you pick the death. Have fun. I know what you could do here, right? Uh, would Red Beast die 100 0? I mean, there's quite a bit of support, actually. Pan did just get fucking actually murdered with, like, a bunch of cards, so. 
I don't know. I thought that was the case, yeah. I, they didn't think this was the case, but I did. <laughs> oh, look at the aura flowing! <laughs> That's pretty cool. Interesting, man. Just, that was just a spammy one, though. You could tell. We'll do one more and wrap it up. Match is Sun Family again. So one day it was just spam reps, and now today it's just spam Sun Family, huh? Interesting. What? I guess you expected a blast from Pan, but why would I not swap there, right? Okay, draw a blast here, maybe? Doesn't matter. Combo done. Oh boy. You're dead. Pop this. Can I tap in this setting? I think I can. I believe so. Indeed. Get the fuck out of my face. How the fuck? You can't make this shit up. You can't. Green card galore. From where? Who knows, but green card, green card. With your spawning. <laughs> oh, Legends, you are a goofy little child. And a rush with the first combo. Right, right, yeah. That, that's the exact shit I'm talking about where it makes no sense. You deserve to get guessed, because you done nothing. You didn't even earn the rush, you just got fed. A little bit weird from Legends, but you know. Ay, ay, ay. Swap. Be arrogant. There you go. Is he dead? Yeah, that's why I have your arrogant there. Good. Go for some silly shit. Make my life easier. You're gone. You can't do anything. Goodbye. Vanish gone. Goodbye. You're dead. See ya. Kaput. Out of here. What could you do? Theoretically, I have no idea. Good doc, right there, exactly. How the fuck did he get a rush? I think that was like less than 10 cards. Like, genuinely. Hey, when that shit happens, it's just so stupid. Like you have to run such safety, like endurance, survival, indestructible, like you have to run some bullshit like that because how stupid that shit can happen. Despite rising rush and nerf on the Dragon Ball rate, where was the nerf there? Who knows, right? That shit just faded away for him. Because Legends deemed it. But overall, uh, Blue Beast, I mean, you can see, he's still very solid. Uh, nothing crazy, you're gonna like run him in meta. But again, this is the issue with hybrids where you would argue you could probably run Blue Beast as core if, again, you don't feel safe with double supports. I don't feel safe with double supports because what happens? One time, just a hypothetical. Okay, they got a PV, and, uh, or rather, they PV your strike or your blast or your blue or whatever with your red beast, and it's red beast, pan, go tanks, or cape, or whatever the fuck you want to use, and you get rushed, or you get one shot. How do you win? You can't. At least with blue beast, yes, your fighting chance is lower, because red beast is much better, but you at least have a fighting chance at that point with, uh, setting of two offense units over just one so that's where you argue blue beast instead of another support and then the fact that you can argue a 13 month old character instead of another character is kind of a dilemma for hybrids hopefully they got that amended with a new character i mean purple sweater trunk should have been a lot better than he was um the ex troll and gohan should have been a sparking so that could have been a choice you know a tag unit for hybrids kind of kind of a thing they should have by now um just saying i mean go tanks and i mean go tank trunks always fight together like how do we not have a tag unit of that that, that doesn't make any sense to me but um go on and crow and always fight together in dragon ball z the early parts of it and we only have an ex unit of that so i don't know what they're doing but what would i think of blue beast i'll see you guys in the next one